Madeira cake is a classic sponge that can be flavoured with ingredients such as stem ginger or chocolate and hazelnut. But I like it best baked plain and served with a nice cup of tea. Now to begin with, I've got some low pack baking. I'm going to pop it into my food mixer. Next, I've got some caster sugar and the grated zest of one lemon. You can use a regular electric hand whisk if you prefer, but these standing mixers just make it a little bit easier. And then we need the juice later, so just set the lemon aside and let's give this a mix. And then once the mixture is nice and light and fluffy, I'm going to start adding the eggs one at a time. Next, I'm going to add some sifted flour, a pinch of salt, and then we need three quarters of a teaspoon of baking powder. And finally, the juice of half a lemon. Give that a last beat. Now I've got a loaf tin that I've put a liner into. You could use greaseproof paper or a circular tin if you prefer. And let's just spoon that mixture in. There we go, make sure you get all of the mixture out. And then just give the tin a little shake and then it needs to bake for about an hour until it's risen and golden brown. And if it starts to colour too quickly, just cover it loosely with some foil. So our cake is looking lovely and we just need to make sure it's cooked all the way through. Just using a skewer, pop it in and it's come out clean so we know it's ready. So all I'm going to do now is sprinkle a little bit of caster sugar over the top, leave it to sit in the tin for about 10 or 15 minutes and then take it out and leave it to cool completely. And there we have it, a classic Madeira cake. And for more of my recipes, don't forget to click to subscribe to the Waitrose YouTube channel.